Hi everyone, how long will my eternal wick paint can emergency heater actually burn for? We're doing a test right now, so you can see. It's now 8.07 and both of these are running. That is the inner case on the left and that is the inner case with the outer case on the right. What I'm going to be doing is throughout the day, I'm going to come to see how they burn. Just to show you how this is a basically an eternal flame. It'll keep on going as long as you fill it up. The one on the left, I'm going to continue filling when it starts to go down a bit. And the one on the right, I'm just going to let it burn down to whatever it wants to burn down to. So we see how long it burns out. And that should help answer the questions that everyone's asking about how long will it burn. It's been a, about a half an hour, so here it is. 837 and taking a look at them they're just starting to burn the paper this one too who it's an invisible flame if you look at it from the side you can see yes they are on can you see that I can feel it on my hand this one you can see a lot better so I haven't refilled that one yet I'm gonna let them go a little bit but it's been half an hour and still going strong it's been going for about an hour now it's 9 13 a.m. and you can see how this one that I haven't touched yet is starting to burn into the wick and this one I actually refilled it I blew it out probably a couple minutes ago let it cool off for a few seconds and refilled it and this is how it just continues to go it's now 9.45 a.m., so we're about an hour and a half into the burn. And you can see this one here is starting to burn into the wick, or let's not be fancy, the toilet paper. <laughs> and this one here, it's still just burning the fuel. And if you remember, about a half an hour ago, I just replaced the fuel probably with about, I think like a quarter cup or a half a cup of the denatured alcohol. Let's check how hot the cans are getting right now. Okay, this one here, it's 57 down towards the bottom. I'm actually able to pick it up, which I did a little bit. And let's bring it up a little higher. It's actually 80 degrees at the top, so it's getting pretty warm. 86. Matter of fact, what is it in there? Ooh, a balmy 250, 400. <laughs> 400 and 300 so between three and four hundred degrees inside there. Let's see this one here By the way, I did take you folks advice last time by putting my washer to open the can out here Instead of on the cap. Thank you very much Some of you have said put it on the handle which is a great idea as well. So let's see how this one's doing down there it is 54 68 so the sand is getting warm 82 85 So you can see how some of that warmth is coming out into the sand in fact You can see almost a different discoloring in the uh, top of the pan here. Is it getting warm? Yeah, it's getting nice and warm So it'd be a great hand warmer and what is it inside there? It is a balmy 700 and 56 Oh, it's so high. It's just saying hi <laughs> The sand is 350 so you can see the sand does get a little warm Maybe that sand will dry out <laughs> So it's now 10 15 in the morning and it's been going for about two hours And you can see that one here is the perpetual flame because I keep on refilling it and this one from one fill up is still quite a bit left in there. It's just starting to burn into the wick. It's now 1044 and I've been so busy this morning I haven't had a chance to keep on top of it. But you can see how this one here is burning pretty well. In over two hours. And this one here is starting to burn the wick. So I'm going to blow that one out and put some more fuel in because I really don't want to burn the wick. I'd like to keep that one for a long time. 
Okay, so here it is, 1121. So it looks like about three, almost three and a half hours. And that one's still burning strong over there. But this one here, okay, I can feel it's still lit. You can probably still see some flames, but it is just about burnt out. Yeah, you can see, you can still see some of the flames. You can still see some of the flames dancing around in there, so there's still warmth. But that is just about used up. So what you would have to do now is, when it's burnt out completely, get that out of there, put in another roll, and you're all set. So how long does this heating system burn for? If you keep refilling it every hour or so, indefinitely. If you don't, in about three and a half hours, it'll be used up and you'll need another roll. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye now.